The Royal Solomon Islands Police Force was established in 1954 to provide a safe, secure and peaceful Solomon Islands. The RSIPF strives to provide an efficient, capable and responsive policing service. Today, we will speak about police and how it receives and investigates corruption offences. Procedure him or him usually of the complainants have a right informal complaints. Girl or commissioner of police, then commissioner of police and refer a matter for corruption team through Office Blomi and go down to director National Criminal Investigation. Corruption team of the garden two prioritizations on model where Okata survey prioritize him of the cases where Okata receive him depending on a lot of funds where him involved law fraud and uh, information where I'm coming in. For making all the measures for me for implement them and all the guidelines for investigation, I'm always done by public body and come through commission. Me for us have creating to some for awareness to the law role block commission and how now the process of corruption matters I'm done. So upon receiving all the corruption uh, complaints, yeah, me for us have conducting investigations and me for us have initiating to all the complaints for go law team. CCAC, waiting me fella. Corruption, me fella still got him avenues for put him in place for how no referrals from me fella by him done. What time now by CCAC can take him matter for investigation or what time now by him refer him. Come lo me fella. MOU, I'm still in draft and uh, pa me fella develop him two policies for the sake of secrecy of information when me fella pass him between two fella agency.